So in the Dragon Ball Z movie, History of Trunks, um, basically future Gohan and future Trunks are in a world where Goku has died of the heart virus that Trunks came to the past to cure Goku of, and basically the androids have destroyed the world. But you guys already knew that, and most of you guys know how Gohan knocks out Trunks in order to keep him from going and fighting the androids because he didn't think he was ready. Well, this comment came from Mr. Quick Account, and he says, Remember when future Gohan knocked out Trunks to go defeat the androids? Well, what if it happened vice versa, and instead Trunks got killed? So then future Gohan would have to go into the past and kill Mecha Frieza. So future Gohan versus Mecha Frieza. And, uh, I don't know why you guys flagged this as spam. This was one of the better ideas that I've, you know, read in the past while, and I don't know what he meant by that mum do 8 thing. I tried to look up that guy to see if that was the guy who originally posted it. I couldn't find it, but anyway, regardless, that is the request, and CPU difficulty is not very strong. Let's do this. So, um, you know, because you guys have a lot of future Gohan ideas, and this was one of the ones that stood out to me a little bit, so I'll probably go super at some point in the battle, but I'll start out normal. Um versus Mecha Frieza, because, you know, he's basically saying, like, what if Trunks just went Leroy Jenkins into that shit, and, uh, like, I guess died, you know, because, uh, Gohan didn't knock him out and save his life, basically, and so then Gohan decided, alright, it's gonna be my duty, you know, Bulma gives him the time machine, I guess, to go into the past and save the world and everything, so, um, this is whole, this is basically opens up a whole new scenario, this is like, what if future Gohan was around and not future Trunks during the Cell Saga and everything, so, um, I don't know, so I'm just gonna keep doing this and starting this out, I'm starting it out on this map because this is sort of the closest thing that I can think of to where, uh, the Mecha Frieza junk happened in the show, you know, um, I was trying to think of where him and Cooler and King Cold came around and everything, or not Cooler, I always, I always like to think that Cooler came with Frieza and King Cold, but he didn't, I don't really know why I have that thought stuck in my head sometimes, but I do, so, um, He's in Raging Soul right now, so I'm going to try to keep my distance from him, if at all possible. Um, I might go Super sometime. If I can get away from him for a second, but this is going to be a little hard, and I fucking hate Super attacks, so... I mean, um, signature moves, I mean. And I tried to do my Masenko right there, but BITCH! Okay, so now I'm going to try to charge up some key. I know that's kind of risky right in front of him, but I'm going Super, just because, because I think this is where he would decide to go ham on him, you know, because he's, um, he's finally going all... Like, Frieza's going ham even more than Gohan is right now. So now that I'm Super Saiyan, this might get a little bit easier. Um, but yeah, so I'm just going to keep doing this. Boom, bitch! And um, it would be cool if you could have like a future Gohan in this game with his arm off, because that's what happens you know, after the androids fight him and stuff. I'm pretty sure that happened before... You know, he got killed. He had his arm ripped off. So technically, if this were to actually happen in the show, then I'm pretty sure Gohan would be missing an arm by now. You know, um... I don't know. Take that however you will. But I'm just gonna go ahead and do special boom cannon and he was guarding. So, um... Yeah, let me... Boom! No! Oh, shit. There we go. Um, this is not turning out too... Oh, I, I was really kind of expecting him to go ahead and go straight into the combos and shit, but he just kind of went there and stood there. But, uh, alright. So... Boom, bitch! Okay. And I'm gonna go down... That sounded nasty. Um, maybe that was just me who made it nasty. I don't know. But, um... Alright, so this is not turning out to be incredibly, incredibly easy. Um... Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Maybe if fucking Future Go on uh, had a sword, then he could just slice and dice this bitch with, you know... Um, wait, why did I use Hyper Masengo? I really didn't want to, but... And wow, he guarded that one, too. Mecha Frieza is so damn defensive, like, it's unreal. I've noticed that. Uh, which, I guess if I was made out of armor, too, and I had already just fucking died, I'd probably be a little bit cautious and careful. You know, if I was made out of a bunch of makeshift parts and everything, I probably would be a little bit leery of fighting Gohan. You know, I would be trying my best not to take any major hits. But, um, let me try and see if I can get an actual super attack in on this guy while he's not guarding. And that just about killed him. Perhaps I could finish with an ultimate. That would be cool if I could. Um, I've been doing that a lot more, and I can't guarantee I do that all the time, but it is cool when I can. And fierce combination. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Alright, fuck ultimates for now. No, I was gonna go for the awesome ass little big punch there or whatever, but yeah, so oh shit. Mecha Frieza is an asshole. Hyper Missing, go to the face, bitch! Even if he guards, that should be enough to kill him. So yeah, there we go. He's dead. My arm, if you notice, his arm was kind of slacking there for a second just because he was worn down and shit, I guess, but um, I'll be doing the other end of this fight. I'm anticipating this to be a little easier. I don't know, mainly because I don't think Gohan will be quite as defensive. He'll, he'll probably play more offensively, but I don't know, so um, let me be Mecha Frieza. 
and switch it to, um, I'll go ahead and give him Super Saiyan, just to keep it fair, because I kind of doubt he would transform. He might would, but I can't guarantee when he would do it, so I'll just give him Super Saiyan just for the hell of it, for the whole battle. Um, but yeah, so, I don't know, you could say I'm giving him a little bit of an upper hand, but, uh, he probably wouldn't need it, honestly, to be able to beat me, because I'm not that great at this game. But anyway, so let's just go ahead, well, boom, bitch, and I get the first hit, technically. He was kind of guarding, but I broke it, and whoa, I thought that I could have stopped that little snap charge attack majigger, but I guess I couldn't, so... Um, let's go ahead and kick him up. I do this combo a million times a day, but, uh, it doesn't matter because it's a beast combo. I love it. And, whoa, and I'm kind of dodging around here. All right, there we go. That's not too bad. And boom, bitch behind you, and tripped him. All right, um, guess I could do this really close because I'm an asshole like that. Um, it's kind of my equivalent of the special beam cannon for Mecha Frieza. This has already proven to be a lot easier, like... Holy crap. Which, I know I'm just getting cocky, and right after this, he's about to go beast mode on me and really start kicking my ass or something, but, um... Yeah, so, whoa, no, 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 no. Boom, and, all right, I actually want to have some time to charge up some key. I wouldn't mind going into Raging Soul for a little bit. Okay, so he's got his power up to the Vera limit. So he, his melee power is up at the same time that he's uh, that I'm Raging Soul, so we're probably about equal in terms of melee. But a cool thing about Raging Soul is my defense goes up as well, I, I think, so, you know, um... Hey, right, whoa, shit, and there we go, boom, and I'm I'm gonna try to wrap this up, or I, I, I might try to finish with an ultimate, just because I couldn't with Gohan, but yeah, um, I'll see about how far I get with this Raging Soul on and everything, and boom, I'll probably throw him up in the air, and that'll give me some time to charge up once Raging Soul is done, possibly enough to use an ultimate to wrap this up, um, boom, and okay, so I will go for the ultimate once... I get a better shot at him. Is he about to charge towards me? Because that'd be a good time to do this. There we go. This will be a cool time. Supernova to the face. And he's probably... Oh my god, are you serious? And no one wants to be hit by ultimates today. I mean, I guess I wouldn't want to either, but still. And I'll just punch him in the air to finish him off. And that was so much easier as Mecha Frieza. Like, you have no idea. Um, if this were to happen... Based off of this, I would say Frieza. But everything else that I know, all of my other instincts would tell me future Gohan. But... I have no idea. This is really weird. Um, I don't know if they accidentally made Mecha Frieza r pretty good at, in this game or what, but based off this, you really can't deny it looks like Mecha Frieza would win, but this would be so cool to watch in the anime, because now I'm curious, because this goes against everything I've ever believed, but anyway, that is the end of this fight. I would like to thank you all for watching. Hope you have a nice day, and goodbye.